Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today going to be a quick video on <clears throat> how to reevaluate your post op surgery with the implant and um, healing abutment and the soft tissue and see what type of tissue or predictability that you have in the outcome of the long term implant uh, restoration. You are looking at the healing abutment of the Nobel BioCare. Uh, con con connection uh, parallel um, system. Um, you are looking at the healing abutment, and you can see that <clears throat> once you put the healing abutment in, <clears throat> you let the patient come back about four weeks later, five weeks later. <clears throat> the tissue is supposed to look nice and clean like this, and <clears throat> you can see the uh, buccal uh, keratinized tissue. That is a typical area where people have a lack of correctinite tissue and would you would worry about it. When you have a thin biotite, you have a high risk of rum recession and potentially the implant will fail. But in this case, you can see the way it look. It look very solid. There's no bleeding around. The implant uh, inside looks shiny. That's how you get ready for taking the final impression for the uh, crown. So again, what you are looking for is no bleeding around the implant, no bleeding around the soft tissue. Uh, taking an x-ray, confirm everything, and you're ready to take the impression. Anyway, really quick video just for you guys to have an idea how what type of tissue you're looking for when you are taking out, off the uh, heel and abutment and ready for final impression. Thank you. Take care. Bye-bye.